thanks for checking out my guitar lesson on the guitar solo for Run. Uh, really cool throwback classic rock style solo um, that I love so much. It's kind of got that Hotel California guitar solo vibe. Um, I also did another lesson for this song with just like the main riffs and stuff. And uh, I'll put the link for that below. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Um, let's go ahead and get into this solo. Uh, be ready for your fingers to hurt from all the bends. And um, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I'm just gonna do my best to explain this in pieces, kind of slow. And hopefully you can um, gain some knowledge from this lesson. And <laughs> that's the only, the only guarantee I could make is that I'm gonna do my best here. So uh, let's go ahead and, and try this. So what you're gonna do is start with your middle finger 13th fret of B. And this is all in the 12th fret pentatonic box of E, E minor. So middle finger, 13th fret of B, index finger, 12th fret of B, ring finger, 14th fret of G, index finger, 12th fret of G. So you're gonna do that twice. So this next piece is a bend. So your ring finger sets down 14th fret of G. You're gonna bend that note up. Set your pinky down 15th fret of B. So you've got. So one more time. So that's gonna be a pluck, return, pull off to 12, and then back to G. Uh, 14th fret of G. So we've got. One more time. Now we're gonna do this little slide up thing into the next bend. So your ring finger can kind of slide in from anywhere. Um, I'm gonna just kind of start, you can start at kind of an arbitrary place and just slide ring finger up D string to 14th fret. And then index finger, 12th fret of G. Okay, so here's what we got so far. Okay, now we're gonna get into the next band. Same spot, 14th fret of G. This time index finger, 12th fret of high E. So, again that pull off, down to 14th fret of D. So here's what we got. What do we got? <laughs> Okay, then we're gonna do our arbitrary slide up on the D string again, 14th fret of D to uh, 12th fret of G. This time we're doing a huge long bend and I like to use my ring finger for this on the 15th fret of the B. So you're gonna bend that up and just hold that for quite a while. Like if you play along with the jam track later and work on the timing, you will get that. So you gotta hold that, that bend, and then we're gonna do a big long triplet run down the uh, E pentatonic blues scale, all right? So what it's gonna look and sound like is this. So you're gonna bend that B string up on 15, index finger, catches the 12th fret of the high E, then you're gonna walk the scale down. 15th fret of B, 12th fret of B, 15th fret of G, 14th fret of G, 12th fret of G with a little bend up. That's that attitude you hear in there. Then you're gonna continue down the scale. 14th fret of D, 12th fret of D, 14th fret of A, 13th fret of A, 12th fret of A, 15th fret of E, 12th fret of E. One more 
force on it. Okay. Now, right after that, we're bending 15th fret of B up, okay? Pinky hits 15th fret of high E, okay? Now you're gonna bend our favorite spot again, 14th fret of G, twice, okay? So you've got 15th fret of B, Now we're going into the little um, rhythmic slide riff is what I'm going to call it. So your ring finger is going to slide in arbitrarily on the A string this time to 14th fret. Index finger, 12th fret of D. Then you're going to bar B uh, and G in the 12th fret. Now you're going to play 14th fret of D to 12th fret of D to 14th fret of D. And I think you're going to do that twice. Okay, then we're going to do something kind of similar. So that's just working down to 14th fret of A. Then we're going to do this, kind of that, we've done this riff one time already, 14th fret of G, our favorite spot, with 15th fret of B ready to go. Alright, so one of those. <laughs> Alright, now we're going to do what reminds me of the Hotel California solo. You're going to bend uh, 14th fret of G up. I think I plucked that five times after, and you let it come down slowly. So you bend it up. One, two, three, four, five, maybe six. Maybe I like six there, okay? Then we got this riff. So that's just 12 of G, 14 of G, Pluck, band, back to 12 of G, then to 14 of G, then 14 of D, and then 12 of G. All right. Right after that, you got this big pluck on the B and high E string, all right? So it's just boom on the open B and high E string. So you've got. All right, now what we've got is um, some uh, uh, double stops with a bend. So your index finger is gonna set here on 12th fret of high E ring finger right here on 15th fret of B. And what I like to do is try to pluck, you're gonna pluck both strings, but you're gonna bend your ring finger up. And you're gonna do that twice. Okay, then you're gonna slide this exact position up two frets, and then you're gonna go like this. And you slide up one more fret. One, two, three, four. Now you're gonna take your ring finger and set it right here on the 17th fret of the high E. And with all your might, you're gonna pluck and bend that. Bend that up and let it return. So let's see if I can even remember how to play this now. <laughs> so we'll start from the beginning. So we've got
Kind of sucks playing it slow because you just kill your fingers with all those bends but hopefully the sacrifice was worth it and it'll help you guys learn how to play it um, feel free to slow that down rewind it back do whatever you have to do don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and i will see you on the next video